the sun and the fun. But wait. Before you soak up those rays, let's talk about how you can protect yourself from the powerful UV rays of the sun so that you can maintain your youthful and healthy skin. I'm Dora, I'm an unconventional pharmacist turned functional medicine nutritionist, and I help my patients to thrive while minimizing the use of medications using the power of food and their body's natural healing abilities. So let's buckle up and dive in. First things first, let's talk about sunscreen. Choosing a safe and effective sunscreen is the foundation of healthy skin aging. So look for broad spectrum sunscreens with an SPF of 30 or higher. These protect against both UVA and UVB rays, which will prevent premature aging and reduce your risk of skin cancer. When shopping for sunscreen, make sure you flip that bottle and read the label. Avoid sunscreens with harmful chemicals like oxybenzone and octinacate as they can be absorbed into the bloodstream and have potential health risks. I personally like to look for mineral sunscreens. These typically contain zinc oxide or titanium dioxide. These are physical barriers so they sit on top of the skin and protect you against the sun rays without actually getting absorbed into the bloodstream. Although sometimes they can be a little bit white and pasty, so you got to find the one that works best for you. To make your sunscreen selection easier, head on over to the Environmental Working Group's website, ewg.org. They provide a list of safe sunscreens and rate them based on their ingredients and overall safety. It's a great resource to find reliable and environmentally friendly options. So if you click on this, you'll go to this screen and you'll see there's actually a spot where you can put in the name of your sunscreen to check on its safety. So enter right here your sunscreen and do a search. I generally will look for an EWG approved product or at least one that's rated a 1 or a 2 on their site. And if you can't find your product, just head back one page and click here and you can look up some of the more common ingredients in sunblocks and see if yours is safe. Now let's see how this is done. If you're going to be out in the sun for a while, be sure to apply your sunscreen about 15 minutes before exposure. A good rule of thumb is about a handful for your whole body. And if you're really worried, you can apply the sunscreen twice to get extra coverage. And don't forget to reapply about every two hours, but more often if you're sweating a lot or if you're swimming. Did you know that certain foods can provide natural sun protection from the inside out? It's true. Foods rich in antioxidants like berries, citrus, and leafy greens can help protect you against UV damage. Red and orange fruits and veggies like tomatoes that contain beta carotene are especially good at protecting your skin against sunburn. So be sure to include these foods in your diet to help protect your skin and keep it healthy and young looking. When it comes to fashion, don't forget to accessorize. Wearing a wide-brimmed hat can provide additional shade to your face, neck, and shoulders, reducing your sun exposure. Plus, it adds a touch of style to your sunny adventures. Well, there you have it. With these tips, you can still have fun in the sun while keeping your skin safe and protecting against premature aging. Remember, try and find a mineral sunscreen and go to the EWG website if you need help. And don't forget those fabulous sun accessories. Thank you for joining me on this journey towards optimum health. Don't forget to follow, like, and subscribe if you want more tips on how to thrive while minimizing the use of medications. Now get out there and enjoy the sunshine.